Alright, so hey, what's up? This is D Money, and uh, this is kind of a nuke tutorial or whatever. I don't know. Just trying to, you know, walk you through how I got a nuke. I mean, it's not a big deal. I mean, I'll tr explain to you why it's not that hard to do. I mean, uh, I've had four in three days, and I really don't play that much. I mean, the last three days I've played a little, but I mean, if you know how to do it, and you just have to play a certain way, uh, it's really not that complicated. So here, here I kind of started, at the start of this game, you know, I'm playing Domination, and that's, for me, either Domination domination or Demolition. Domination's a little easier than you, but um, Domination for me is probably the easiest one to have to get it on. Um, all right, see right there. I just got blown up my own claymore. That was kind of mad. You know, right here I'm like going to the nuke, right? And um, you know, uh, yeah, I have claymores. The class I use is a uh, favorite class is definitely the ACR, with red dot, uh, scavenger, stopping power, and steady aim. Um, see, so yeah, I don't know how I didn't see the kid in the left, but yeah, I just got knifed by him. But um. So I like to use claymores and just, you know, I mean, I'm not that, I mean, I'm pretty good at COD, but I'm not as good as, like, the really, really good people, so, like, you know, I use claymores, I don't really trust my judgment sometimes in getting, going out in the open, you know, and getting a ton of kills, but, I mean, I don't necessarily camp, I'm more of a, I'm really bad at camping, actually, I'm more of a rusher, but, you know, here I just kind of stay... You know, right now I'm, I'm doing okay. I mean, I think I'm like plus six or something. You know, I kind of just I'm not like camping, but I'm like staying in the back, you know, and not necessarily rushing in. But you know, I am moving forward and still playing the objective somewhat. Um. So yeah, you know, right here I'm just kind of. I mean, I've already had like one or two kills so far. I'm just, in this little kill streak, so kind of just looking at their spawn, seeing what they're doing. Not really wanting to rush in there and get killed. Um, you know, the best kill streaks by far for getting a nuke is Harrier Strike at seven, Chopper Gunner at eleven, and obviously the nuke at twenty-five. Um, so like, really, you put those on, it's gonna be easy to get a nuke. I mean, not easy but you know that's the easiest way to get it by far AC-130 I don't really like it I've never really seen anyone get a nuke with an AC-130 the only nukes I've seen is with chopper gunners so that's why I use it um you know just you know I'm just running around watch my back but you always gotta move around you know not you can't just keep killing people in the same spot cause people take vengeance and just come after you and start killing you, so that's why I move around a lot. You know, I don't, I think that's pretty basic. I mean, I'm not trying to be like, I'm not trying to sound like I know a whole lot about COD because, you know, I still ask people like how they play and stuff. And how like, you know, it's just, once I got the first nuke, it was pretty, I mean I got three more the same day, and I only played in like a three hour span, so. At the moment, I'm working on my fifth one. But, I mean, a lot of people, they just get a nuke, and then they're like, okay, I got a nuke, so I'm just going to take it off, because, I mean, it's more useful. You get more of, like, if you use less ki kill streaks and, like, I mean, it's more useful for the game if you use, like, an airdrop instead of a nuke, because you're going to get an airdrop a lot more. So it's going to help out your team. But, I mean, nukes are fun. Right now, I'm getting a Harrier Strike, and that's really just... Once you get a Harrier Strike, you're pretty, pretty good. I mean, you just... Well, you need four more kills, and you get a chopper. Right now, I don't know why I'm rushing, but I mean... I could just let my Harrier do other work. Right now, I have nine. Ten. About to get eleven. I don't know when eleven's coming. I don't know. See, I could have got killed right there. I was, I was glad that they got A, so I could camp. And I have chopper. I'm just waiting for someone to 
getting in a position where I can use the chopper and not get killed. Because, you know, it really pisses you off when you get 24, 23 and you die. So, if someone knifes you while you're chopper gunning, so that's, you always want to camp. You always want to get into a good spot before you put your chopper down. And, I mean, this is a good map for chopper. Uh, I've gotten on this map twice, and I've gotten on a rundown once, and on a high rise once. It really pisses me off when I get choppers on like Skid Row or whatever. These little inside maps, and it's hard to kill people with chopper gunner. And I'm glad no one shot it down. I mean, once you get a chopper gunner, it's pretty much over. As long as it's an outside map and you're not getting like destroyed, you know, and you're not like, you know what I'm saying, but, uh, so, yeah, I'm pretty much just going hard right now, I mean, not that hard, just using the chopper gun, like I said, once you get that, see, I just got the new, once you get that, and then I call it in, and once you get that Harrier Strike, and you're, you don't really rush in, you're pretty much, you're all good, so that's what I would do. I mean, ACR is by far my favorite gun. It's so accurate. It's really nice. Steady aim. It's crazy. So, um, hopefully I'll make more videos. Check out my montage. Uh, you know, I mean, good luck playing COD. I mean, it's a fun game. It pisses me off sometimes. It pisses everyone off. So, it's all good.